Well, this meal looks rather interesting. Yeah, I apologize. The macaroni didn't cook right. I think I let it I think I let it boil too long. Patrick, why don't we ever go out? What are you talking about? We're together all the time. Yes, but we're always inside. I wanna go out. I wanna go have fun with other couples and not just be us inside sheltered from the world. Well, I kinda like it being just us. There's no one to distract from us. Well, I can't take it anymore, Patrick. I wanna go out. That's stupid. I don't see the point. Look, besides you, your awful cooking, why do I come over here? Because you're my boyfriend, yet we never go out. Are you ashamed of me or what? Am I too fat for you being such a hot set and all? No, no, I'm not ashamed of you at all. I'm incredibly lucky to be with you. I'm still not sure why you chose me, but if anything, I'm ashamed for you to be seen with me. Don't be ashamed. We go great together. I just want to go out in the world and show all those unlucky single girls what we have. I just want to, I kind of like rubbing my happiness in their face. Okay, babe. We can try and go out. Good. Because if this doesn't work and we can't go out, it is over between us. And don't make me regret meeting you at your roommate's party. So, how was dinner? Uh, awful. She wants to go out. <laughs> Isn't her and you going outside of the apartment? Yeah, you gotta help me, man. I don't know what to do. You gotta help me. Okay, okay, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. But you're going to have to do something for me. Something that I've been asking you to do for a very, very long time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is this enough? This is ridiculous. Shh, watching my stories. That's it. I quit. I want to hold on to Christy, so I'm going to take this into my own hands. Dude, you know I'm going to help you. Shut up. You mean it? Of course I mean it. No. <laughs> oh, Jesus, stop. No, that's good. Okay. That's good. Stories. <laughs> Kill the TV. Rise and shine, Patty Bell. Boot camp starts now. You got this little abnormal feel, and you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna attack that fear. We're gonna make you a pretty damn good boyfriend. How are we gonna do that? Ask me how, ask me how. How are we gonna do that? We're gonna wrap you from head to toe in whatever we can find. We're gonna cover every square inch of this pasty white body and then we're gonna kick you outside this apartment. Are you ready? <laughs> then get up, get up, cause we're going, we're going, come on. You ready? It's war out there, son. It's hell, it's chaos, but then there's still that little girl who's out there waiting for you. You ready? You ready? Let me hear it, let me hear it, let me hear it. Go! So mission number one didn't go so well, did it, Patsy Klein? Hmm? No, but calling me names isn't going to help and motivate me to think. Well, you're right. I'm sorry about that, Patricia Arquette. I'm sorry that you weren't born with any golden girls between your legs. What's your next idea? I want to hear it. I want to hear it. I want to hear it now. What if, what if, what if I, I call food in? We can order in. It's not me cooking. No, you're right. That's the perfect idea. That's the solution we've been looking for all along. Except that you can't even answer the door to pay the delivery guy. You're right. That's no good. I'm about to get upset. Okay. I'm about to get upset. Chocolate milk break? Uh, 
It's a good idea. Yeah. Well done. <sighs> yeah, a little. No. Uh huh. No. Right. Up higher. Right. Right. No, uh -huh. right there. Don't don't mm -hmm. fight me. Don't fight me. There. Thanks. You're welcome. What if I just told Christy about my fear? Explained it to her. Underdog strategy. It's bold. Probably won't work. Worth a try. Call her up. Get her over here. Okay. It's delicious. Hey, go on in. Patrick! Your mom's here. Chris, come, come sit down. Are we finally going out? Uh, we'll see how this conversation goes first. Okay. The reason why I can't go outside is because I'm terrified too. It's not an uncommon fear, it's called agoraphobia. Not uncommon? Are you serious? You can't even open the front door when I knock. When Dylan's not around, you just unlock it so I can let myself in. That's beside the point. Look, Christy, I love you and I'd rather not lose you because of this, but maybe we can take things slow and over time you can cure me. Pat, I am a hot commodity. Do you understand how hard it is to date a guy in college who cannot leave his apartment? There's nothing else for us to do except hibernate in here. I want to go out. Chrissy, what do you want? I'll be it. What do you want me to do? I'll do it. I want to go out and have fun. Go dancing, go bowling, walk in the park. Typical couple stuff, you know? But it starts with you opening that door and taking a step outside. Okay. I can do that. I, I can do that. You, you're sure this is what you want? Yes. Uh, remember, I'm doing this for you. Okay, Patrick, just do it. Look, I did it! The, the door is open! The door is open! Good baby, now just get on the stairs and see if you can open the outside door. Turn the knob and open the door. That door? I don't know about that. Do it or we're through. You know what? Screw it and screw you. You're a two-faced hussy that tries to rely on society to tell you what is good. I hope you get hit by a bus when you walk out that door, princess. Change. Don't admit that your faith is weak. Don't say that you feel like dying. Life's hard and it feels like diamonds. Going home's just far too gone. Much too late to even feel like trying. Can't understand what I'm saying. Can't figure out what I'm implying. If you feel you don't wanna be alive, you feel just how I am. I'm on the dark side, and you can't come find them. Hell when it's light all around you. Yeah, when it's dark all inside them. No winners when it's me against me. One of us just ain't gonna survive. My heart been broke for a while. Yours been the one keeping me alive.